I don't know if this will apply to you just because, you know, you even talking about Roddy Piper back then you loved. And then later on, you know, Shane Douglas. So you kind of had a thing for a lot of heels, it seemed like. But was there any heels that drove you crazy? Because I because it's a compliment. You know, I always like, you know, I'll frame it as you know, the most hated wrestler. But it's a compliment because that's what they want from you, right? They want you to hate them. They want you to get the reaction. But with the kind of fan you were, kind of reminds me of when I was a teen, you know, I went through phases where I definitely hated wrestlers, but once I got to like 2004, 2005, I loved heel Randy Orton. I loved Carlito. I loved Mr. Kennedy because they were just cocky and brash. And I liked that as a teenager. But before then, of course, there were people I hated. Did you have that phase? Yeah, definitely. Uh, but it was more like, um, like Sean Waltman. I didn't appreciate ever. So mm-hmm. like X-Pac, I was just like, no, please beat him. Um, I was, I think maybe because I was never like the biggest guy. And also, I was a very heavy set kid. Um, I had some resentment for like heavier wrestlers, so like uh, an earthquake or something like that did nothing for me. I think because of that a concept of like, oh, I this if I got heavier, I could be this person. I I wanted, you know, they usually say the things that you hate most are things that you you see in yourself that you don't like. And so for me, being uh, a non athletic kid um, and being close to three hundred pounds, I definitely was more leaning towards like the athletic type and all that other stuff so if there was a heel even if they were a great talker that just looked like somebody i was like oh i i don't have the confidence to be that person uh I, it would be a turn off to me wow I'm getting really psychological here <laughs> honestly i love that i love you know one thing about this channel is uh and you're you're close with sal and we'll probably bring him up later sal renaro uh channel I love sal. he's one of my best friends We've had three interviews. He's been so generous with his time. And we got to like 2007 throughout three interviews just because you go back and forth so much. And it's just the way the channel is. But in regards to Sean Waltman, was it Xbox or was it one, two, three kid? Because one, two, three kid, you know, with the baby diaper and baby powder, that was a lot of heat. (laughs) That was a lot of heat. It was one, two, three kid because he just seemed so obnoxious and he, it, I didn't appreciate how good he was in the ring. I mm-hmm. just looked at the whiny kind of character of it all. 